Hello guys, welcome to the Amazing Ants channel. As you can see the decoration is finally finished. What do you think? Do you like it? Please tell me in the comments below. The bigger stones are made by myself. I used some scrap from the cinder blocks, painted them with plaster and then with acrylic paint. It's pretty easy, you just need some time for all the details. Well, everything looks fine so far, but there's only one major problem, moisture. There's too much moisture in the nest. I'm using a computer wand, one heat map from beneath and two heat maps from the side to reduce the humidity of the nest. This setup is running for days. But in the bottom left corner you can still see condensed water on the glass. But it is already getting better. I think I can start the move this week, so you guys can see the master colony moving into their new home in the next video. If you want to build a formicarium like this and you're going to use a heat map from beneath, Please make sure you make the cinder block really dry before you fix it in with silicone. If you make the same mistake like me, it takes some days until it's dry enough. And believe me, it's pretty annoying if you want to move in your colony and you have to wait for days or weeks just because of condensed water. Let's have a look at the ants. The master colony is still growing so rapidly. They always want to escape. The nest in Outworld is definitely too small for them. I've already had some escapees. There have been like 20 or 30 ants out of the nest. Luckily the ants didn't get far away from the nest. They have been exploring the surrounding area. Actually it was pretty funny to watch them exploring the new territory. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Feel free to leave a comment or like. I'm always happy about some feedback. If you don't want to miss the moving of the master colony, please make sure to subscribe to the Amazing Ants channel. Thank you guys, see you soon!